Hello everyone, this is Waldorf. And this is Statler. And today we've got Battle Report 67. 067. You know, 66 should have been the Demonic Legions. Yeah, you should have done that differently. Should have reversed them. Even though they happened in this order, I should have done them it the other It doesn't matter. You can, numbers have to stick. Seven versus six, you know. Good point. All right. Uh, Kingdom of Ectrotain versus the Demonic Legions at Huzzah Hobbies. Huzzah! It's the first time we're seeing this, Mark. This little symbol. Yes, it Look is. It. Something uh, new. You know, a uh, big six-pointed star with... Well, six, seven, Eight eight pointed star. Eight pointed star with a whole bunch of eyeballs. <laughs> You're too old to count. I can't eight count now. anymore. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was kind of freaked out by all the eyeballs, and it looks like dead fish. <laughs> the uh, fish skeletons. Yes. And then you got a nice Equitane emblem. Which, I do. Even though it's not colorized, at least it looks somewhat impressive. It is not a poo pizza. I need to get somebody to color that in for me. Yeah, your talk to me knows how to use. Why don't you uh, get on? Why don't you get on that? Um, I tell you what, I will, I won't be that one, but I will do something for Equitain. It just seems to be appropriate until the Ninth Age folks release something at the end of this okay. year. We should have something more appropriate for an army of such standing. Oh, no. <laughs> the, I'm, I'm starting to dread this idea. <laughs> hey, All right. It's going to look better than the poo pizza, I guarantee you. Okay. That. All right. <laughs> yes. I'll take that. That would be hard to... Not achieve that. That's what I figure. A crayon and some yes. paper, and I'm, I'm golden. <laughs> All right. So here's my list. It's the same list you saw in my last uh, video. I'm still stuck, still on Druidism. You mean you haven't changed this army since we recorded the last one 10, 10 minutes ago? No, and these games were played back to back. So yes. um, it's the exact same army list. Take a, take a minute, pause it, and read it if you'd like. Exactly. I am on so, still using Druidism for this one. Exactly. The, the term I think you use is suboptimal. Suboptimal, as in Druidism, or this entire list? Yes. <laughs> okay, I'll go with the yes. All right. So, uh, moving on. This was the deployment where you're... It's the attacker defender. So, he's forward in the center. I'm back in the center. Okay. So, I had to deploy this way. You if, had to? Well, I didn't have to. I could have deployed over here in the woods yeah. or deployed over somewhere <laughs> else. But I'm not... I'm okay with this because I can wheel around and I think I'm okay. I actually don't have a problem in deploying uh, lances sideways. Yeah. I think it's kind of a strategy you can do that because then your opponent doesn't know where you're going. Right. As long as you do your that, spacing that properly. It. That's what I was doing. That was your plan? That was what I'm doing. But usually when you do that, everyone's kind of facing in sort of the same direction and no. not in the middle of your battle line. Okay. But okay. Well, I, I'm learning. So anyway, you can see I don't, again, don't have a list from I am. You're, He's slack, got you're just slacking, man. Two of the cannon chariots, unit of uh, the, what are these called? The big dogs, the war beasts. Uh, I mean, they're yeah, not dogs. They're not, they're not little chaff dogs. I, I don't know their new name. The big monstrous things. Yeah. Wrath uh, hounds. Wrath hounds. Knows? 30, yeah. 30 blood letters with a. No, they're not blood letters anymore, right? Yeah. <laughs> Warriors demons of Wrath. Of wrath or demons or of Wrath. Demons of Wrath. Are, I don't know. With a guy, with a hero guy that's in okay. him, gives him hatred. Yeah, okay. A uh, unit of five furies? I don't know if they're furies or... Okay, flyer guys. Flyer guys. A uh, big heavy... <laughs> we need to review this army book review, so just so we know what things are called. That's a good point. <laughs> yeah. Um, big, uh, the heavy chariot. Not the cannon one, the other one. Oh, that's right, because they're limited. Chariot. They can't have three of Correct. the cannons. Yeah. Uh, Scourge of Wrath. Oh, my. Uh, another unit of ten of the Demons of Wrath. Is it possible for them to have two Scourge now? I don't think so. I don't, I don't think it is, but... Uh... And three Crushers, which are bearing the standard. Yeah. The standard of hatred. Yeah, I just have to say that if you don't <laughs> win this game, you're dead to me. Yeah, well, you know... <laughs> So anyway, so there you have that. Um, I taunted him. Let's go back previous. I taunted him, said, if you look, if you don't get the first turn, you're just going to be having that demon of wrath sitting right there on top of the hill. Is that what you're doing? <laughs> so he backed him up. Uh -huh. <laughs> so I already considered that a win. The, uh... Uh, anyway, there's the other side of his army. It's a nice, colorful army. It's a very, it's a nicely painted It's very army. blue. It's very blue and red. And They're not very wrathful. They're I'm, very sad. At, I mean, look at the nice wings. Yeah, the wings are here, nice. Really yeah. dwell. Anyway. Yeah. Moving on. I mean, it's okay. It's okay? Yeah. Well, it suffers from 
poor banner choices, but you know. <laughs> uh, one in and, particular, huh? And and the and an attachment to rocks, rock candy. Yes, he does like the rock candy. Yeah. So gives this guy something to eat. Uh, I actually got first turn. Okay. Uh, we roll well, off. before we get to that. Sorry. Um, back up one, please. Previous. Yes, so our battlefield is ah, their battlefield. It's similar the to our last it's, battle it's report. Exactly the same. In case a person hasn't watched the last Correct. battle report, we've there got go. two forests. Two forests in chaotic green woods felt. Yes. <laughs> At least with, you know, with demons, it, it seems like it's okay to have strange colored so green that don't normally exist in nature. Uh, uh, a hill a here. Hill, which is covered by guys. That's covered by guys. Another, Another hill, hill over here in the corner, which is nowhere in the terrain, and a, a wall. A wall? Hedge. hedge. Yeah. Wall. Which is now in wedge formation. They only, yes, it changed formation. And the object, the secondary objective is the single one in the middle? Still the center. We rolled the same, yeah. we rolled the different different deployment, same uh, objective. I don't like that objective, but... That's uh, what you roll. Yeah, I just, of the ones that they have, the ones I like the least, because it draws people into the middle. And, you know. Right. So there you have it, moving up, just kind of getting in position there for the... For the onslaught. Okay, so you bring up your guys. Bring up everybody. Get in there. Look at that. We're all happy. Yeah. Uh, Trebuchet decides to fire and kills a crusher and puts two other wounds on the unit. And, uh, yeah. Okay. I tried. Yeah, all right. Um, and the other one... I'm trying to figure out how they fired hanging off the table yet again. They always hang off the table. Yes. It's going to be a thing. It's my <laughs> thing now. Um, so there he is checking his charge ranges. He elects not to charge, rather, just kind of moves up. So, you went for the just for curiosity. So, you sent both trebuchets against the crushers. I sent them both, I could not see the scourge of wrath. Okay, so I decided to send them both against the crushers. You couldn't see the scourge of wrath, he was behind the hill. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, it was his turn. Yes, okay. it was his turn. Okay. So, he was still behind, and the you hill. didn't, you didn't want to thin out that big horde of dudes. No, I've got a plan for that. Okay. All right. So, um, or the harpies with their clipped wings. With the, <laughs> yeah, so I can, yeah, so I can do nothing yeah, extra yeah, to the harpies. Yeah, yeah. Um, so anyway, so he moves up there. Uh, there you have it. Mm -hmm. uh, no shooting. I mean, no shooting to speak of. His cannon is fired. Did I get track of that? Yeah, there he goes. His cannon's fire and picked off a knife. So you managed to get wet, stuck in the corner again. They like this. This is the same spot they were last time. <laughs> yes. See, they've got one dead from the so cannons you, so firing at been, them. You're being outmaneuvered. Okay. One cannon has fired and uh, <laughs> yeah. misfired and can't shoot anymore for the entire game. Okay. So we got that going for us. Oh, it's not like it can charge and fight you. Oh, wait. <laughs> it can. So, um, And this is the second game of the day, and I'm all in. Let's go get them, boys. Yeah. So the Peg Knights... Charge, uh, that's incorrect. The peg, peg Knights originally were thinking about charging this guy. Uh huh. And then I asked him what the stats were on this, and then the Peg Knights quickly redirected over here. Yeah, yeah. So on to the Crushers. Yeah, the demonic Crushers aren't quite as potent as the. Uh... They're not. <laughs> um, and they've only got four wounds left total. So yeah. I'm kind of okay with that. Yes. Um, the Aspirants. Okay, no charged. character in there this time. No characters. What's that? No character went with them. I'm sorry, never mind. Anyway. Forget yeah. I'm confusing myself. Yes. The yes. Aspirants launch their attack into the, whatever these things are, uh -huh. the Demons of Wrath. The big unit. So you're hoping you can do enough. You're hoping that they don't kill enough of your guys that you can do enough because they have better initiative. Yes. <laughs> the big unit of my Knights of the Realm charges here, needing a 16, which charging, is an 8. Who are you charging? I can't tell. This this big oh, demons of wrath. Horde. Yep, because I'm charging them as well. They need a 16, which is an average roll. They need a 13. They need a 14. Okay, so you're all. Setting, so you're all in. I'm all in. I'm going here, and if they all get in, I think I can pop them and go through them. Yep. That's what I'm looking for. Uh huh. And what could possibly go wrong with this? Uh, I can think of a whole bunch of things, but can okay. You? All right. Well, you know, you're thinking a little more than I was. <laughs> anyway, so there we have it. That's what it's looking like. And, of course, these guys make it in. That's him just pulling them off the base and re okay. reassigning them. You can see these guys over here, the aspirants have made it in. Okay. 
when you look over here, there seems to be one unit missing, and that's the... The largest one. The unit I needed. With all your characters. The yes. unit I needed did not make it in. Yeah, yeah. Other than that, it went according to plan. Well, the important thing is you remove that, uh, you know, offensive banner. Offensive banner? So... No, that's not there. It's still there, actually. <laughs> the... uh, over here, um, we managed to kill three. He killed two of us. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, not terrible. <laughs> um, yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, <laughs> That's pretty terrible. <laughs> it's pretty bad because I rolled terribly yes. on my attacks. <laughs> um, anyway, over here, yes, I didn't even bother taking a picture. <laughs> um, he did three, four, five wounds to this unit and one, two, three to this unit. Yeah. Won the combat. By and I did, I think, five. Yeah. Won the combat by like two or three. Very small number. Um, and I broke both of them and fled. Had these guys been in there, he would not... He still had everybody fighting. Because I was... Each one of these had to be on four guys. I mean, five guys. So he had everybody fighting. He could not have done any more wounds than he did. And I would have had all these attacks in addition. Uh, yeah. But I was relying on an eight, a seven, and a six. Yeah, and he still probably would have been there, though. And Maybe. Yeah. Could be. Um, but anyway, so we broke, <laughs> ran off here to the right. Yeah, this... These guys ran over here. These ones he elected to pursue because it got him more towards the center of the board. Uh-huh. Uh, and there's an overhead picture of it. And he's checking his arcs to see if he can come to their rescue. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Because they're so desperately well, get, in trouble. It gives him something to do. Gives him something to do is what it comes down to. Um, so there you go. On his turn, he ends up charging past them into here, into my yeoman. Okay. Um, after these guys charged, sorry, the big... Charging demons these. charged off these guys and then redirected, and redirected into there. Into there, um, and this wrath guy, Mister Wrath guy, tried to charge and failed. Oh, okay, because uh, he was on the flank. He was on the flank, which would have been messy. Yeah, um, but he did fail. Um, over here, the dogs charged and caught my knights. The other knights were running the other away. knights that were fleeing in the in the edge of the woods. And the flying critters came up here to be within position for position to kill either one of these trebuchets it wants to. Okay. So there you go. Um, Can his dog see your flank too? Over here? Yeah. Uh, probably. Yeah. Uh, I don't think it matters. Um, anyway, moving on to turn three. Oh, and you notice though. Let's go whatever next. Oh. Um, Peg Knights have managed to kill one of them, but he's killed two of mine. Uh-huh. Uh, and that was on the charge, so that didn't work out well for me. Yeah, because he's, what, toughness four? Four up armor safe? Three up armor safe? Four up armor, five up ward, I think. But he goes before you do? He goes before me and knocks me down a little so bit. He, so he killed two of your guys before you Correct. struck? Yep. Yeah, that would make sense. That's. I think he killed one before I struck. This is after the second combat okay. round. Okay. And he killed another one in the second round. Um, over here, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And you only caused one wound. That's kind of bad luck. With yeah, you. I did not do well. He had devastating charge and correct two knights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, again, yeah. Because he has his ward. He might he's doing it. well on his ward saves. Yeah, he's making ward saves all over the place. Yeah. Over here, he didn't do a lot to me. Right. Um, but it was enough. I spread out this way, which I should. I spread out this way to keep the Scourge out, this guy out. Because now he's in my front and he can't charge Okay. Me. It's either that or I stayed long and he comes and hits me in the flank. Uh huh. So that was my thought. Did you have to spread out that far? Yes. To do that? I checked it with just moving one, you know. You could have just slid over, right? No. Uh, the reform rules, you have to keep the exact same models in combat. The enemy must have... At the end of the combat... Every enemy model that was in con in contact the first turn needs to be right. That was before the reform has to be right. Within there. Right. So when I was in contact with these over here, 
So I have to leave these three over here in contact. Oh, so you were barely in contact with that end guy? Yes. Oh, okay. So he had the five so, on so his end in combat, so I can't slide at all. Yeah. So I shift down to here just to keep him in the front because right. I figure as bad as these things are, he's worse. Yeah. Um, so anyway, over here his chariot has hit my um, yeoman, crushed him and overran and taken out my so, fleeing knights. So why didn't you just stay in your, your lance for that? Your turn. Your turn's next, right? This was, this was after, no, no, this was after my turn of combat. Okay, okay. Then I had nothing to charge. This is just okay. a fight. Oh, so you've already fought your. I've already fought combat. my round of combat. I fired uh, both sorry, trebuchets sorry, and sorry. yeah, put three wounds okay. onto him. Okay, so you hit him some fire. I hit him with a. With you a killed trebuchet. a few more of them, and then you spread out. Correct. Okay, I misunderstood. Yeah, yeah. No, it, I did not do it the first turn on his turn. Yeah. Correct. Okay. I stood on the first turn, then after the second round of combat, spread out. Okay. So, anyway, so that's uh, going into turn three, and after this turn, this is what it looks like. There's a lot less guys because you brought more into combat. I brought more into combat, and he didn't have the hatred this turn, and his strength was down. Yeah. So I thought it would be a little bit better. But still a lot of attacks. A lot of attacks. Over here, he's killed my, um, the whatever the flying guys are, killed one trebuchet. The trebuchet, yeah. He, he, these guys, the dogs have killed the other one and reformed. And reformed the face of you, yeah. And the Scourge of Wrath has flown down here. Yeah. He is on the other side. Uh, there's my dead knight. Is that the old GW? Turn. I guess it's the old, G it's the old GW, GW model. model. Bloodthirster model. Oops, yeah. back up previous. Sorry. And um, that's <laughs> where it is. The screen has gone black. Or was that me? <laughs> the screen went black. Okay. The world went black. That was the, vi that was the view from my lord's uh, <laughs> yeah. perspective. Okay, I was just checking. Um, you know. This was turn three. We didn't play turn four. Um, <laughs> as you can see... The Scourge is going to be in the unit. I've got three characters left. The Mage has two wounds on her. The one character has one. Uh, my General is unwounded, but... At least be able to use Audacity. I would be able... Uh, no, because the guy with Audacity is on the right side. Yeah. And the Scourge is coming into the left. I see. Yes. Oh, unless unless he sends yeah. the dogs in. They're tough five, I think. Or yeah. strength five. But you could, you could slide over. Um, because you're engaged in the front. I could do it if I could manage a combat reform. I could. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But he's got two ranks, a banner, um, and looks like six wounds. Right. Oh, I thought you could make way as long as you're engaged. You can only make way if you're rank. not in combat. Yeah. Make way is for if you're not oh, already yeah, yeah, fighting. Yeah, yeah. So, and I managed to do with two <laughs> two lord level characters. I managed to do two wounds. Okay. Um. So. Um. And like I said, this was a quick one. That was the end of it. So no army. So tabled on turn four. Tabled on turn four. But, yes. But you killed the offensive banner. I did kill the offensive <laughs> banner off. Yes. I did manage that. That was my one my one achievement in this goal. I got zero points from this game. Well, I want to know, did you uh, pop any of that rock candy off his base and have a snack while you were waiting? <laughs> <laughs> this right here? Yeah. Yes, I took this I, one. I see a lot of rock candy. So, I took you know, this one right here. You might as well you know, have he, a nice little meal while you're uh, playing. He likes his rocks, doesn't he? He likes his rock candy. So All I right. guess he's got a sweet tooth. Yeah, this was a complete disaster. I thought he was um, just an alcoholic. I need to uh, <laughs> yeah. do better. Well, demons are a tough army because they there's are. no fleeing. And, uh, yeah, and these big blocks of troops, you just can't really fight them. No. Even um, pawn your guys up. They're just going to hold you up and everyone else is going to swarm you. Correct. Yeah, the only thing I was hoping, like I said, I thought that I had that one chance of maybe breaking them on the charge. and. Yeah, you got to do so much to them. And get but him, I needed to do Getting through all those five ups. Because it's a fixed five ups. So. Correct. And then you're counting on doing a lot of hits. And yeah, and depends how many guys you're going to lose because they go first. It, right. It's, it's a... A horde of uh, yeah guys that go before you that can hurt you and don't run away is right. It's a it's a well challenge for this army. I had a when I looked at it, I did have the opportunity had I done it and hit them and taken significant losses. Yeah, but one I had the opportunity to go wide with my remaining units and keep out of the arc of the uh, scourge of wrath. Oh, did you? Okay, I did. Um, unless I stayed three deep, yeah, if I would have stayed three deep. He could have hit me. Okay. Yeah. And then I could have done played it and put the three deep unit on the far right. Right. Anyway. Yeah. I had some opportunity, I thought, there, but 
It did not come off. Yeah, but you saw a few guys you actually killed in the... They seem squishy, but they're not as squishy as they seem. No, the five up ward save is that's what the five you know, up ward save. I mean, that's if somebody like gets hot, then you're screwed. A third of them, if, yeah. You know, on average, if he gets hot, right. I've got no chance. Um, so anyway, that was the uh, quickest battle report we've done. And yep, it would seem so. And that was the worst loss I've taken in a long time. <laughs> yes. Okay. So thanks for listening. Till the next time. I'm gonna go home and cry. Lusa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Why don't we start recording some more of yours? All right. <laughs> All right, thank you. <laughs>